Good kin internet. Uh, so stat update. I added some highlighting. So the three characters whose levels are highlighted in red, they're... Actually, I don't like the highlighting in red looking quite like that. Let me fix that really fast. Do, 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 do. Just red text. There we go. That's a little better. And it didn't do it anyway. Whatever. Um, point is, the characters who are highlighted in red are the ones that are above average party level. Now, not median, but average. Um, median party level, on the other hand. Let's see. That would be those characters. So it basically looks like uh, median party level is Luke, effectively. So anybody with more XP than Luke should probably stop getting as much XP. Um, average party level, on the other hand, really, I just need to watch out for Jaha, Kiwi, and Bowie. And Jaha and Kiwi are kind of leveling on their own at this point. They aren't really gaining levels by virtue of what they're doing in combat. So what I would like to do is exclude them. Four, comma, C, six, C, seven, comma, C, nine, two, C, 13. Yeah. This is actually where the problem is. Um, actually, I think I have an idea. Let's do average. And let's do some different conditional formatting. Didn't think you'd see Excel in here, did you? Okay. Between there, there, that's not what I want to do. Cancel conditional formatting. Format all cells based on their values. That's not what I want either. Oh, screw it. Deal with it later. Anyway, point is, we have a cup we have some unbalanced party situation going on. Even excluding Jaha and Kiwi. The highest level is over three levels higher than the lowest level. I know it's not as bad as when Peter first joined us, but it's still pretty bad. So I'm going to be focusing more on trying to get Peter, Kazin, and Slade up. And Sarah. Also, it's been a while since we've had a new character. Are you the boy who killed the legendary Kraken? I got to Hassan thanks to you. I didn't know this was such a dull town. What's that? It's the caravan. An ancient vehicle found in the shrine. I love interesting things like that. Oh, you found it? No, we actually murdered somebody and stole it. I want to go with you to see more interesting things. Rick the priest. I have a second healer? Okay. Adventure! Yo-ho! Let's go! Okay. What are you like, Rick? You have heal and blast. Well, now I have somebody else that's low level. Uh, let's get your stats. Oh, your hit points are bad. But it's interesting that you don't- you only have two spells. That means that whatever other magics that Rick has are higher level. 
So it could be Aura sitting in there. It could also be stupid freaking sleep, like what um, uh, Kiwi has. Yeah, come to think of it, it's actually possible it's Dispel and Sleep. That would suck. But anyway, new healer. New healer, best healer. Okay. So now, we're going up here. I probably should have added some healing items. So this is the dried up riverbed, and what we can do is that we can use the caravan to go across the dried up riverbed. We came from Grands to look for Mithril. Recent earthquakes have buried the tunnel. My friend is sick now, and we can't dig the tunnel without him. Found a dry stone, which is actually something I need. Much, much later in the game. It's going in the caravan. <sighs> Cold. I'm so cold. One of us went to look for the fairy. I hope he's alright. So, these are dwarves, by the way. They are mithril miners. It's the first time that you actually get told about mithril. Speaking of, let's put the dry stone in. Oh, not a praise. Yes, I changed my mind. Store Bowie. It's dry stone. We don't need dry stone until way toward the end of the game. All right. Okay, we got in. This is a hidden city, by the way. If you couldn't tell from the appearance that you could just barely see. Oh, you can't see at all because I still have Excel up. Do you see the slight difference in green? That's the only way you could tell this place even exists. There's a bunch of hidden things in here. Fairy powder. I'll rebalance items later. Fairy? She has not returned from Greed's mansion. They say a fairy lives around here. Do you know her? So yeah, that's the dwarf that was looking for the fairy. Welcome. Travelers often stop by here to rest. You may stay here as long as you like. This is known as the Hidden Elf Village. The Creed Mansion? Only the fairy knows how to get there. But maybe Elric knows, because he's a friend of the fairy. Bowie investigated the area. Bowie found secret book. It's time. Nothing was there. So... I really think I should promote Gerhalt as soon as possible. Gerhalt is currently level 21.4. It's a little low level for me to promote. In my mind, Elric's out. He went to help find the fairy. He went to find the fairy to help a sick dwarf. The forest to the west is very dangerous. There's a lot of hidden things in here, by the way. Let's see if I can remember off the top of my head how to do this. There we go. Another piece of mithril. Just had to walk in a canopy. But there's something else over here too. Welcome to the Fairy Woods Special Stage! How quickly can you defeat all the hidden monsters? Now, set a new record. Best record so far is 5,999 minutes and 59 seconds. Are you ready? No. Oh, what a pity. Please visit me anytime. So that is an infinitely repeatable stage that doesn't require you to have any monsters on the board. It is the easiest way to level somebody up as long as you have... Um, Whatchamacallit, um, uh, what was I saying? Uh, as long as you have a way of um, having somebody gain experience on their own without having to hit things. 
Figure ball's the other thing that I wanted to make sure I had. Um, so, like, for instance, boost. B this is the way you grind boost like mad. It's because you could just set up your party where you just rotate between three things to boost, and that's it. You're constantly gaining XP, and nobody's there to harm you. Nobody's going to attack you. It's a really efficient way of grinding. But more importantly... Um, a little bit later, um, if you use a ring, like, say, for instance, the power ring that we have, or a ring that we're going to be getting a little bit later, um, you can keep using it until it starts cracking and then just teleport out. Just keep doing it. It's another way of getting XP, and that one is a way to do it on any character. So it is what I'm going to use to, once I get the protect ring, which the protect ring is very similar to the power ring in that I can use it as an effect in battle, except that the protect ring's effect is boost. So I'm going to get the protect ring and then start grinding up the characters who are not in my party. So currently we're at 12 characters. 12 is the maximum party membership. So the next character I get, I would have to kick somebody out. I'm going to do my darndest to give everybody an equal amount of XP. It may not work very well, but it's one way, like, for instance, the situation I have with Peter right now, where he's lagging behind and I'm having to put so much effort into keeping him up to date and keeping him up on levels. I don't have to worry about that anymore. I'm not going to grind to make things easier for myself, but I will grind to, um, whatchamacallit, even out everybody's XP. Especially since I want to see what everybody can do, and I don't want to just look things up. Sorry, there was a knot in my headphone cord. So first thing I'm going to do is save. Because I'm going to start using promotion items just to see what happens. Like, what are people going to get? Okay, so first off, let me show you what a normal promotion is. I'm going to save state here. Actually, wait, I'm going to save state back here. Okay, so this is a normal promotion. I'm going to... Let me investigate all of you. Who do you want to promote? So I am going to promote... Geralt. Geralt wants to be promoted to a... To the A uh, fighting class. Gotta love the translation issues. To the, uh... To the A uh, fighting class. Geralt can be promoted to Sork with the secret book. Then Gerhalt can be promoted to Wiz. So I have the option, because I have the secret book, of either one. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to promote Jaha. I'm going to promote him to a Sork just so we can see what he would be doing. I am not going to promote him with a Sork, regardless of what the end result is. Unless if I see, like, Dao Aura Boost and Bolt or something like that. I've already decided that I am not promoting Jaha. I just want to see. Now let me conduct the rite. The light blesses Mage Jaha with a glass of Sork. So with promotions, not only does it reset your level and in the sorcerer case, give you new spells, but it also changes your appearance. Okay. What can Jaha do? He just has Dao. That would be a terrible plan. This is why I save stated. Well, that and I wasn't planning on doing it. Okay. This is a little early for me to promote. Do I want to promote Gerholt now or later? So Dao is more powerful than Blaze in general. Um, there's certain situations that Blaze is more powerful, but there's not too many of those. Blast is useless. Dispel is useless. Egress is a very nice ability, but... Yep, let's bring him to the A fighting class. Let's... Yep, I'm aware. Let's see if he retains anything more than Dao. I don't think he will. just has Dao. Okay. So here's the thing. 
I can promote him early, and spell-wise, he will be better off promoting now than he would be promoting later. The problem is that his stats are lower, so you retain all of your stats on promotion. So the longer I can level him up, the better his stats get. But I think in Gerhalt's case, he's lagging behind so much that I have to promote him now. That's my decision, and I'm sticking to it. This is the earliest that I've promoted a Sork since I started playing. He's only, he was only level 20. He only gained one extra level worth of stats. That's not so great. And he's going to per be permanently lost. He's going to have a permanent loss in stats. You know what? No. I'm not going to promote him for now. I'm going to at least get two chessboard. I'm not going to necessarily go past chessboard, but I'm at least going to get two chessboard. I thought that was an exit. Apparently not. I'll just go out the way I came. Anyway, there's a battle right here. Like, this is the furthest that I can go without entering into a battle. Maybe? Can I actually avoid the battle? I think I might have just avoided the random battle. Neat! Yep, I just avoided the random battle. So I'm going to save state and then show you the random battle. Because I know there is a random battle. Or there's a normal battle here. See? So it is actually possible to avoid battles in this game. Now, in this case, this battle only has Dark Madams. High Priests and Orcs. Those are the only new enemies. It might actually be worth me fighting them anyway. Just because I have two characters that are low level now. I need to get Rick up higher level. Badly. Very badly. <clears throat> and I also need... Yeah. I have too many characters that I need to get higher level. Let's go ahead and go through this battle. When do I get the Protect Ring again? I just looked this up, too. That's the dumb part. Uh, let's see. Protect Ring is... Isn't that at Creed's? Protect Ring. Yeah. It's the battle right before Creed's. Okay. Okay. That's the point that I can start going back and basically power leveling people. <laughs> um, yeah. It's not going to boost as many people, but I want to boost my new, my noobs. I just really wish the party wasn't in order of earliest to latest joining the force. Oh, wow. That that looks weird. We hit a pallet swap that's not supposed to exist. It's sad. I really wanted to show off what Sorks look like. They are the one of the coolest promotion-looking characters in the game. Or, their promotion is one of the coolest-looking ones in the game. There we go. That's what I wanted to phrase it as. Gargoyles are not really going to give me any XP anymore. So I'm going to leave the gargoyles to the weaker members of the group. I also have a Vigor Ball. So Vigor Balls allow me to promote to Master Monk. The problem is that I don't know which priest I'm going to promote to Master Monk. <coughs> I was going to look at level 20 and find out which one made more sense. <coughs> Let's look 
looks so evil. I guess I could actually just power level Rick on my own, now that I think about it. It would not be that hard. Maybe I should do that. I am really high level by comparison. Uh, do any of these people have items? Power stick. Steel lance. Power stick. Shining ball. Yes, they do actually. So, shining ball is a one use magic attack, it's a terrible item. But it's rare. It means it's also worth money. You know what? I'll just fight through this. It'll be fine. It's not a desert battle, so I'm not anywhere near as bad with them. Forest battles, and I have a bunch of elves in my party, so it should be fine. Mm, getting eye strain. Oh, I didn't even see that gargoyle up there. Well, that's fine. Everything's fine. Especially now that I have two healers, everything's definitely fine. Really? You're hasted, you're not, you're not, you are. Man, it's still worth it. Recording for the past 22 minutes. It's not too bad. Damn it, mage. Keep forgetting. The whole preview thing not matching their actual classes keep throwing me off. Stab? Ooh, that was not much of a stabity. That's better. Soul Sour's attack. Going after May. Yeah, May might be screwed from this. Okay. <sighs> I'm just full of all sorts of bad ideas this time. Yep, that's what I thought was going to happen. Ooh, I survived. I was not expecting that. Yep, you're going to attack Gerhalt because Gerhalt's weak, and then he's going to get arrowed and die. Hmm. I lived. You know what, Gerhalt, I would prefer you to live. Although, oddly enough, resurrecting Gerhalt would have been cheaper. That's fine. Peter, finish off this goober. 
You can deal five, right? Yeah, you deal eight. Okay. 38 XP. Level 20, thank you. Uh, it took so long. Just heal yourself. It's going to be easier. You're level 20, which means you're actually on the lower level side now, so go ahead and stabs. Level 21. This magic's so terrible. So in regular Shining Force 2, Kazin is the first mage that you get. And at this point in the game, Kazin's the only mage that you have. Kazin's magic is terrible. He has one offensive spell, like normal damaging spell, and that's Blaze. That's what he starts with. At this point, he'd be at Blaze 3. He gets it really early on level-wise, which also means he has nothing to do for most of the rest of his levels. He gets that and three status effect spells. Um, I believe it's Dispel... I don't think it's Sleep. I think it's Dispel... I don't remember. I, let me look this up. It's not hard for me to look up. I'm on the website and everything. Kazin, your magic by default. Uh, Muddle, right, the useless one. Uh, so Muddle level one, all Muddle does is cause you to have a lower chance to hit. It's kind of like a blind status effect from a Final Fantasy game, only you have a chance of it, it's like a 60% chance of it working, and then there's just a chance of them missing. Muddle two actually confuses enemies, which is better than nothing, I suppose, but it's still not great. It's just mediocre. Is there any of you goobers actually injured? No. Um, so yeah, he gets Muddle, Dispel, and Diesel. Diesel is an instant death spell. Upside with Diesel, hey look, you can theoretically kill any normal enemy in the game. Downside with Diesel, <coughs> it has a 40% chance of success and doesn't work on bosses. S and also... You get less XP for using it, because remember, XP is based off of how much damage you do. DC will technically deals zero damage. So it's a really bad spell. Diesel 2, which the only way in the game to get Diesel 2 is by um being Kazin, is also not a good <laughs> It just it's just really bad. We'll just phrase it that way. Friends don't let friends use diesel. I thought I had another turn. Why did you get to go twice in a row? That's not very nice of you. You're dying now. Eventually. Eventually dying. Yeah, this is going to hurt a lot. Glad this isn't a Nuzlocke anymore. Because, yep, you're going to go after the weakest member of my party. Oh, well, took a hit at least. That's not too bad. Maybe he's the defense wizard? Or defense healer? Peter has no items. I didn't replenish items. That explains some things. Um, you haven't been hit yet. Yes, you have. Have you? No, okay, that's the one that hasn't been hit yet. So I'm going to biff this one upside the face. Just weakening. Okay. You're the one that's going to go next, so you're dying. Only getting 25 XP from them. 
See, that's the problem, is that I'm not getting all that much XP from any of these Goobers. I don't think this is actually going to do anything, is it? Other than boost himself. Oh, okay, Rick is actually needing a boost. That's good. Speaking of Rick, hey, healer, heal. Th you, you could use a heal right now, right? Actually, I'm going to stand there for it, wasting a heal too. Because May is very heavily injured, and I don't want May to die. Kiwi hit 27. No new spells. Blaze 2 should kill you. Yep. Finally get some XP. Unfortunately, these Ubers do not actually give all that much in the way of XP. Um, I don't want to kill it. And this might kill it. Let's find out. Oh, it didn't. Okay. You're level 22, you're not attacking. You're nearly dead. You're just staying there for a moment. Let the healers handle you. It'll be fine. Speaking of healers. Use your dark healing arts, Rick. So Rick is normally a centaur. He's the second knight of the game. I think Rick's stick was defense. Yeah. Or third centaur, second knight. Yeah, so Chester by default is a knight. He has gobs of hit points, so he's very good against magic users. Rick is the defensive knight, so he has high defense rather than gobs of hit points. So he's good against normal melee foes. Rick's probably one of... is a decent choice for a promotion item later on. But there's... Um, coming up... Normally, there's Eric, as opposed to Rick and Elric. There's also an Eric. Thanks, Team Sonic. Thanks, Camelot. Um, Eric has attack as his shtick, which means that he's extremely effective as the other promotion. Um, that is, if you want yet another night. I have done an almost all night party. It's It's a thing. Will you please just let... <sighs> Keeps moving out of the way of the one person I want to actually kill the stupid thing. Uh, I'm about to just start surrounding it. See, he's out of the way of Peter again. You know what? Stay. Stay. You're on healing duty. Stay. I'll take the hit, I don't care. All right, who else is injured? You're down two, you're down zero, you're down lots. I'm going to, once more, go with the ranged one, just so I don't get in line of fire. Rick is squishy. Huh. I wonder if Rick is the defensive one. That would be interesting. All right, I'm still going to get hit by the stupid thing, but at least I'll have a chance of doing something. Like killing it with the correct and correct party member. What is it, Boo? Having problems finding food on the kitchen table again. Oh, 
oh, this is not good. I didn't think I was in range of the gargoyle, which means yep and death. <sighs> and it's been a while since the last... How much did I lose in money? Okay, I lost a lot of money. I lost 11,000, but I have money. It's not that big of a deal. I should have just skipped over the damn book. Battle, just grinded up my healer. That's all I would have needed to have done. <sighs> that was a mistake of mine. How far back was the state? That far back, okay. I'll just go back to the state. I don't feel like dealing with anything else right now. At least this time they moved in a spot where I can actually hit the freaking thing with Peter. Die already, please. Thank you. Peter's the only one that gets maximum XP from these things. Okay. Boost? My kingdom for Aura. I wonder if I'm even going to get Aura this game. So Aura is the area of effect healing. And Aura 4 is the most ludicrously overpowered spell in the game. It's also one of the fastest ways to grind. Okay, what do I have nearby? This goober. What is your movement? Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Oi. I didn't even need to be here today. I could have just fought something else, anything else, anything at all. Could have gone on to the next battle for that matter, but no. I decided I wanted to fight every battle of the game. At least it's not a desert battle. At least it's not a desert battle. Now you're one, two, three, four, five, six. You're directly on that line. But you're six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, you can't actually hit anything right now. That's good. Let's get some more boost. Now I'm in range of the Dark Madam. 
Dark Madam has Freeze 2, which hurts. <coughs> Normally, you don't get Freeze until much later in the game. Much, much later. Well, maybe not that much. But later. Uh, I should have had him heal. Oh well. But in this case, I get it earlier. That's good. I also normally don't have Bolt at this point of the game, but that's okay. Alright, you're gonna nom on a thief. Om nom nom. A boosted thief at that. Dealt nine. That's good. No, I don't want to use Bowie. Bowie is really high level right now. That's not a great plan. Mm, yeah, I should be fine. One hit point. Of course. Well, Gerholt does need XP. Oh, why even bother? Attack. Kathong. Oh, I dealt seven damage. Wait, does the Gerholt actually have more strength than Peter right now? Gerholt, your attack is 30. Peter, your attack is 34. Okay, it's not that bad. Meow. think this is not a terrible plan. Hi, Boo. There's a Boo Kitty on my lap. Boo Kitty. Meow. Heal up the Thief. I just noticed Kiwi is actually still injured. And yeah. Okay, that's not what I was expecting you to do, but sure. Oh, wow. You hit hard. Okay. Jeez. Thump. Look at how thin this tail is. And you can't tell because I'm wearing a black shirt. And... Thump. Boost expired. Soul Sour is going to go now. I'm going to hit Chester in the face. That face. And stunned. That was the status effect Soul Sour is due. Got it. Could hit it with Blast. Uh, you know what? Let's see if that's actually more XP. I don't think it will be. I think it'll be less than 10 XP. It's exactly 10. Cool. No. <laughs> Go back to what I was planning on having you do, which is heal. You are heal bot. That's what Pursts are good for. really don't know what pallet swap Rick is using. Swap. Critical hit for one. Oh, boy. Oh, I still have the stupid power ring equipped. That explains it. Which means I could use the power ring. Slade, get a boost. Sarah, just start stabbing. It's stabbing time. Look at how little XP I'm getting. Ugh.
Bukini. Your nails are very sharp. Or your claws. They hurt when you need me, okay? Ah, uh, yes. Let's boost the stunned one. This makes sense. Shootings? I like shooting. Death did. Yay, it's death did. Yeah, I'm only getting 27 XP, so I'm the equivalent to that level. Luke, come back. Um, you need healing. Everybody else is really far away other than that one orc. Ow. Boo, your tiny claws are so sharp. Oh, you don't have to get off of my lap. Just don't stab me repeatedly. Stabbings are for enemies, not for friends. Anyway, let's take a look at our levels right now. I forgot that Kazin actually got killed. Pfft. And he's going to be lower level than the rest as a result. Ugh. Screw it, we're pushing on through. Just lean back. This is not my normal chair. Uh, my normal chair is currently being used for my work setup. Because um, I'm sitting down quite a bit more for work than I am for home. You leveling up yet? No. Chester is no longer stunned. Hooray! So yeah, Kazin is now my lowest level character. Well, Rick is still for another three more healings, but Kazin will be my lowest level character. Even Peter's higher level, because Kazin's barely level 20. I don't think that's going to do much. Oh, I did three. Okay. Ah, flashing. Flashing bad. Oh, you're injured. Okay, that's good to know. No, oh, not egress. Item use power ring. Save state. Yep, just a crack. Okay. But it does mean I'm not going to use it anymore until I repair it. Because if you use it without repairing it, it just disappears permanently. <coughs> Heal! You are healed. Good job, Gerholt. Elemental Gerholt. Um. Get you another 10 XP. Boring parts. You're staying put. Is there anybody injured? Her halt is a little bit. And that's it. So might as well heal her. Jeez, it's been nearly an hour and I haven't finished. I've, I've only gotten halfway through this battle. I suppose the previous episode where I did an hour and two battles and one of which was a boss battle even. Oh well. 
All right, you just need to move up slightly more, Mr. Orc. There we go. Are you going to kill P Peter? No, you're going to deal five. Okay, that's fine. So, orcs are your basic, hey, look, I hit things hard. There's nothing special about them. They're relatively high defense. And they hit. That's really it. This is barely going to do any damage. <sighs> Sorry, I'm getting tired. Or I can do no damage. I mean, that's always an option, right? Stay. Fire! That's all I can do. Just want somebody to stab it. Stabbing time. Stab. Crit for five? Really? More stabbings, please? You're not stabbings. Heal, because I might as well heal somebody who actually needs it instead of just myself. More stabbings. Stabity. Yeah, so Sarah's definitely worse than Luke on the attack part. All right. I have very little magic left and six enemies remaining. I think I'm going to egress back. So I'm going to pause this until I get back to roughly this point again. I'll be back, Internet. Ugh. All right, roughly back where I was. I'm going to need to pause again to get up once my thing is preheated. This would be extremely dumb. Yeah, I'm not that dumb. That's your normal movement five, so you could probably move to there. You know what, Peter, you're staying there. So, yep, yeah, not much has happened. I've just gone back through again. Everybody's alive. Um... Jaha is level 30 now. He now has freeze 3 because, you know, I needed even more levels of that delicious, delicious freeze. I mean, in some ways I did. Boo Kitty is still crying because she's hungry. She's always hungry, though. Always. Um, is there anybody even left injured? Boo kitty. Oh, you're actually just exploring. That's fine. No. No, there is not. You're actually next to the only other person who can use healing. <sighs> Why are you all not going? Yeah, that work back there I just didn't bother with. <laughs> was not worth the effort. Here you go, May. Here, have two hit points from Evil Rick. I totally want to promote Rick with the Vigor Ball just to see what Evil Rick looks like. So slow. I just need you to move up slightly more. Okay, I think now I can slam you in the face. Uh, let's check your defense. I'm probably doing like one or something. 
Your defense is 37, your defense is 31. Okay. I might actually damage you. Pfft, two. <sighs> yeah, I think I'm going to have to pitch Peter out of my party. That's a phrase you never hear in vanilla Shining Force 2, that's for damn sure. I only cast it on one new person. Oh well. Stabbing's time! Stab. Crit for six. Ugh. These defenses are a little ridiculous. Well, let's make sure the High Priest heals himself. More stabbings. Merry Stabbings Day, Orc. Heal yourself, because you're down one hit point, I guess. I'm going to stop using healing every turn on Kiwi, because she's low on everything. Kazin, smite. Thump. Brief slowdown. That's unusual. Yeah, this is what I was afraid of. Ow! 23 damage. How am I supposed to keep up with that? Stupid bird brains. They're always so weak. And that's my pizza. Be right back. Oh, for reference, uh, I'll show it when I come back. Pause. And back. So I'm actually making this. It's a um, just a pre-made small personal pizza thing. Uh, it's with sweet potato crust and it's uh, chicken and barbecue sauce. Onions and green peppers, it looks like. Um, normally I don't like barbecue sauce on pizza, but this one, the sauce isn't too bad, but more importantly... The pizza's freaking delicious, especially the crust. I love sweet potatoes. And, well, I'm a sucker for sweet potato crust, I guess. I wish I could have healed somebody useful, but, you know. All right. First enemy with heal three. Usually the enemies get heal three before you do. This is a rare exception. Yeah, the gargoyle is going to be playing with us soon. Roll the priest. Special stabbing is back to you, orc. Stab. Ow. Luckily, counterattack doesn't hurt too bad. Uh, fall back. Time to boost. Uh, I was only on Bowie. That's less useful. I think that would kill the orc. And Gerhalt is one of the ones I need to level up. It barely kills the orc. Oops. So over time, enemies... I mean, your fire magic and one does less damage. I'm not entirely sure why, but it does. Uh, no, I'm actually going to keep MP. Thump. It's your turn for the stabbings, Mr. High Priest. Stab. Second stab? Second stab. Death did. Uh, I'm only hitting 33 XP, which means High Priests are level 22. Eh, not so great. That poor orc is never going to enter combat. Okay. One, two. Okay, got that. Hello, Mr. Bowie. Have some healing, please. Dark healing. Yay. Yay, dark healing. Uh, 
Yep, you can attack, and that's fine. That's why I made sure she was boosted. Peter, you're the only one to actually be able to gain XP from these stupid things. Uh, go ahead and save state here in case if I need to run away. I don't think I'm going to need to, though. Might as well continue boosting. Always be boosting. Oddly enough, she's relatively safe there. Good. That's what I wanted to have happen. Just one heal and nothing else. And I'm going to use a healing seed on you so I don't have to worry about healing you with a healer. Blink. Yay. Nope. I'm going to stay behind my wall. Heal up the rest of the way. Ooh, level up. Oh, new, new spell level. Drat. That poor orc is never going to reach me. Nope, staying behind the wall because that soul sour can hit me otherwise. Oh, just retreating. Okay. Kill the gargoyle. You're the only one who can get XP from the stupid gargoyles. 27 XP. Ooh, you leveled up to level 21, finally. Ah, uh, trying to get Peter to level 24 is going to be a disaster. That's an even worse idea. Um, just wait there. So I'm wasting Rick's MP, I'm aware. It's kind of intentional. As in, I don't really care if I use Rick's MP up. Uh, no, that would be dumb. Not walk all the way into there. Yep. Blast. Ooh, blast two. Ooh, I'm taking six damage. Ooh, eight. Eight was almost threatening. Peter, roll him. This is probably a dumb idea, but I'm doing it anyway. Slashy the orc. Boom. Not great, but at least I get XP from it. I can't hit anything. Stabities. What is your defense like? 27. That's actually low, isn't it? Yeah, the thieves have higher defense. And you don't... You have sleep. You know, I don't know if I've ever used sleep. Let's try it. Sleep. Orc fell asleep. Soul Sour fell asleep. That was actually effective. What's going on? A status effect spell that you, was useful? I don't understand. 
Stabbings? Do you wake up from stabbings? No. Good. Shootings? Shooting time, yay. Party time, excellent. Orc is asleep. <coughs> Shooting time death, maybe? Yay. Dropped a shining ball. Kazin received the shining ball, even though I was a range away. Sure, we'll go with that. I got the item, the only reason why I bothered with this stupid battle. That orc is just a lost cause, I think. Soul Sour has awakened, though. Luckily, not D&D definition of Awakened, because really don't want to deal with an intelligent Soul Sour. Peter, roll him! Because, uh, why not? <laughs> oh, right, because you're useless right now. Soul Sour Awoken, so I'm going to slice it in half. More than half. I only gained one XP from it. Oy. There's a mosquito. No, actually, that's a moth. Mm, that might be enough to kill the orc. Nope. Ain't and ain't. Oh, well placed Blast Will now. I don't really have blast to place. I'm just gonna stab this hour. Stab. Death did. I gained 13 XP. Ugh. Okay, who do I have left that's in the 21 department on level? So we've got Kazin, Peter, Rick. That's it. Work's still asleep, so it's safe. My food's ready. Uh, this is running long. I'll be right back. I'm just going to grab my food. This might be the video with the most interruptions. Anyway, this is what the pizza looks like. It's a thin crust pizza. Uh, the crust is, in fact, made of sweet potatoes. But it is delicious. I'm going to finish that off when I am done. I need it a little bit because my medication requires me to have food. And I had not fooded yet. Evil Rick. I really like the color scheme of Rick for some reason. I don't know why. Alright. This should be the last one. Yep. Okay. Good, because I can't buy items until I finish this. And that was the boss. Okay. So I'm going to save this here. I will go back and refill on items and so on, but I'm not going to do much of anything else. Uh, yeah. So I'll talk to you next time, Internet. Bye!